Greetings! Welcome to Saint of the Week, the show where we choose one saint to be saved from this week and discuss their lives and their impact on the church. The saint for this week is Saint Catherine Drexel, whose feast day is March 3rd, this Friday. Catherine was born in Philadelphia, Pennsylvania on November 26, 1858. Her family was wealthy and she received a fine education from private tutors. Her parents were devout Catholics and taught their daughters to practice the corporal and spiritual works of mercy. As she grew older, Catherine developed a deep, special interest in the material and spiritual well-being of blacks and Native Americans. This interest became greater when her family visited the western states in 1884 and she saw the terrible situation of the Indians firsthand. After Francis Drexel, Catherine's father, died, he left part of his $15.5 million estate to his daughters in part to some Christian missions. Catherine and her sisters donated money to a Catholic Indian reservation, but Catherine soon decided that more people were needed to help the Indian situation, not just money. The Drexel sisters received a private audience with Pope Leo XIII to ask about missionaries for the missions they were funding. Leo instead suggested that Catherine become a missionary herself. After speaking to the spiritual advisor, Catherine made the decision to devote her life to serving the Native Americans and African Americans. She took religious vows in 1891 and started her own religious congregation called the Sisters of the Blessed Sacrament for Indians and Colored. Their first inst institution was St. Catherine's Indian School in Santa Fe, New Mexico, established in 1894. Mother Catherine founded many, many more foundations in the years following. By 1942, she had a system of black Catholic schools in 13 states, plus 40 mission centers and 23 rural schools. By the time of her death, she had established 50 missions for Indians in 16 states and 500 sisters teaching 62 schools throughout the country. At 77 years old, she suffered a heart attack and was forced to retire. She spent the remaining 19 years of her life in quiet, intense prayer, recording her prayers and aspirations, aspirations, aspirations in a notebook. Catherine Drexel passed away at the age of 96 on March 3, 1955. She is the patron saint of racial justice and philanthropists. St. Catherine's legacy of charity and love for all people is something we must remember in today's society, where we still have racism in spite of our claims of a civilized, equal society. St. Catherine Drexel, pray for us. Our honorable mentions for this week are St. Maria Bertia Boscarden, St. Gabriel of Our Lady of Sorrows, Blessed Daniel Brottier, St. David of Wales, St. Agnes of Bohemia, St. Casimir, St. Oswald, St. Aubin, and St. Peter of Papacarbone. And of course, there are thousands of other saints who undoubtedly have their feast days this week, but we are sadly unaware of them and so cannot mention them by name. We hope you have enjoyed this episode of Saint of the Week. Thank you for watching and goodbye. Peace, Peace be to you. you.